my beautiful buddies welcome to a cottage living inspired speed build this will be in Veronaville in my save file it is kind of based off this image I found off of Pinterest so it's inspired by it it's not meant to look at like it 100% but this is where the inspiration is also to I guess a little bit of Taylor Swift's um, folklore and evermore album as well um, because I was listening to it and I just was like feeling the vibes when I was um, listening to the album. Anyway, um, I want to say thank you to EA because they did give me a code. They did give me um, early access. However, as you can see, I was like gone for a little while because I was actually visiting a friend away in Colorado and I actually got some vlog footage from that as well as I started a new job rather recently. So if you're wondering like where I went for a little bit I guess like for like a few weeks now that's that's ultimately what happened and like when I get when I got back I was just trying to get used to like a new schedule for me and things like that so yeah bear with me um, because like I have had some like upcoming like busy things going on as well like I also have like um, a bunch of parties for like family members and things like that and I've just been like super duper busy lately basically um, but I always enjoy doing The Sims, so I should be starting to get back to normal in, like, this whole thing. Like, I think, like, after this next week that I'm, like, recording it, I have, like, one more busy weekend, I think, like that, and then another one a month later, but I am going to get, like, back to, like, our normal videos and things like that especially too because veronaville has actually been coming along pretty nicely um despite me having like a little bit of a break here and there um but yeah i just i also want to say if you're wondering why is this house built in the middle of a sp in like in the middle of the speed build um it's because i'm dumb i didn't re realize that i was like recording this video like halfway through <laughs> So I just was like, you know what? I'm like, I tried and I wasn't done furnishing it anyway. So I kind of just picked up where I left off. You guys didn't really miss much, I guess, really, except for me doing the exterior because I was like doing a lot of like the like furnishing and like the kind of like more kind of like stylizing it um, as I went on. So yeah, I'm sorry about that. I made a little boo-boo, but it's okay because we got there in the end and I know you guys would like <laughs> you guys would like to see it anyway because it's such a cute cottage and I feel like it's going to look so so cute with your families in it um with that said if you don't want to wait for the, sa the save file I've already have it up on the gallery my gallery name is the rosebud simmer and that's where you can find it um yes okay well anyway <laughs> something new that's coming to the sims 4 is like when I'm like recording this is, is that they started to do some refreshes to packs so I'm like recording this when um they've like started I think like it's spa day yeah a spa day that's getting the refresh and they're getting new nails and things like that I believe that the update's going to um drop tomorrow from like when I'm recording this I'm not exactly sure when I'm going to upload the speed build I'm hoping maybe in like a week or so I don't know we'll see like like I've said I've been a little bit of a mess lately with like the whole like recording uploading thing but yeah we're, we're trying to get more organized I love doing this I just I've just not been very organized with YouTube lately I just had a lot going on um, but yeah I also did vlog while I was away as well I'm not sure if I mentioned that already but yeah I did vlog so I also would love to like upload that vlog I'm kind of a noob when it comes to like vlogging some of my vlogs like I, I will look back at my clips and I'm like what would, what what the heck was actually going on there <laughs> but I think it just kind of like adds to the atmosphere um of the chaos and the channel sometimes <laughs> but yeah I think you guys will really appreciate that too I think it's like it's something different I feel like than always having um sims content because like i love sims and i just love gaming in general and i think it just is something different like you know kind of like how the Ligacy sometimes does vlogs that's kind of like the vibe i like to bring to the channel sometimes like i like to break it up sometimes and yeah i also find that doing tiktoks or recording for tiktoks is a little bit easier than doing vlogs i'm curious 
to think what you guys think if you guys are um, YouTubers or streamers or you create content yourself. Um, but yeah, let me know too since um, Cottage Living has actually been out for all of us for like a little while now. How you guys actually like the pack. Is it one that's a staple for you guys? Is it one that you guys haven't gotten yet? Is it one that you want? How do you guys feel about it? I've watched some, um, I watched some Let's Plays on it despite me not playing a lot myself because I've just been really busy. Um, and I think it's a really cute pack, really cute pack. I definitely think like there's some packs I feel like that are more my interests. I guess and the more my pro priority I would say than this one was but with that said I feel like a lot of these packs sometimes that come out that I wasn't initially that's like oh this is at the top of my list kind of thing that I really end up liking them and I think this is one of them because I just love the whole animals and I think it's just super duper cute with the whole like cottage core style of things um we were lagging a little bit I would say on the build by catalog this time but there was so much gameplay with this um with this like expansion pack that i wasn't i wasn't mad about it i think it was ending up really really cute and really decent um but yeah i'm just curious to see too what where there are gonna go in the direction too like with these new refreshes if they're gonna hold back on doing some new packs or, and they're gonna focus on like refreshing them or what's going to go on because I definitely feel like there are some packs that really need a refresh like get to work especially and restaurants they definitely need one too um personally I would just love the retail system from get to work to be refreshed like I would love to be able to run a business on your home lot I would love to be able to run it while your sim is away from the lot like you know restaurants and then like the vet clinics too like those have that enabled and you can't do that um on retail lots and just just where it just to be improved because i feel like it's so easy how sims will buy things if you just have like a random stand like one of those like selling tables but it takes them forever to buy things at a actual store like i feel like that should be fixed and there should be i don't know just like a better like ui i think like that for all of like the reward systems and manage employees and things like that i think that would be nice too um also too i think aliens and mermaids from island living should get the same system as vampires and the witches do personally i'm not a huge occult person but i know that for those of you guys that are you guys would probably really appreciate that because i know a lot of people were saying that that um mermaids were kind of disappointing them because there isn't a lot to them and they're a really cute one they're really cute occult so yeah i would curious to see if they ever do that as well um we're also getting some new careers with spa day which is nice because i've been saying that there are some that there are some skills in the sims 4 that are so fun for your sims to do but they're what i like to call secondary skills so they're the skills that I feel like are the hobby ones that your sims purely are hobbies. They can't have anything lucrative off of them at all. Because in the sims 4 there is quite a few like I guess skills or hobbies I guess you could say that could make your sims a lot of money that eventually could become their job. Um, and I feel like yoga was one of them and like I don't, it's not yoga it's not just yoga it's like the I don't know the meditation skill I don't know you guys know what I'm talking about. And like now I think you're going to be able to have a couple new careers with it and things like that. And there's also going to have like nails, like getting your nails done being added, being added to it as well as kids can be able to participate in spa activities as well as facial. So that's fun. That's fun. I'm probably saying this and this is this update I know is going to be probably out for a little bit for like out for a while, like when I'm recording this, but like I haven't seen it yet and I like to talk about these things. So I think they'd be fun um, to talk about. And yeah, <laughs> how do you guys feel about kits too? industrial kit came out not too long ago as well. Um, personally, I think it's a nice kit, but there's nothing really stand out about them. Personally, I don't really know how I feel about kits currently. 
because they kind of just feel like mini stuff packs but there hasn't been one that I have been utterly in love with yet so I don't know I feel like maybe if there was something focusing on like a life stage kit or something like that I feel like that would be really nice but yeah I feel like it was nice like industrial kit I just it didn't it didn't wow me though you know what I mean I hope that makes sense <laughs> um yes I hope it does cuz like currently too cuz as you know guys know I am the EA game changers program even though I've been a little lacking lately um, with my whole time frame as I was talking about and like things that have been going on but like I was even thinking about maybe even doing kits purely on my TikTok channel which if you guys haven't followed now is a good chance to all my links are in the descriptions you can go check them out there um, but just because they're so small and I feel like all the bigger youtubers kind of like go into depth about really dissecting about what they like and what they don't like and i feel like we're all pretty much on the same page i feel like most game changers are i feel like um so i feel like maybe doing those like little speed builds there i don't know what you guys think you guys let me know because you guys are watching the channel and i like to do things that you guys enjoy as well um and yeah, like there's also some video ideas too I was like thinking of too that I think would be beneficial for you guys. Like if you guys want to see more challenges or maybe even more mods like reviews in the future, you guys let me know. Because yeah, like I said, I do a lot of building because like my save file is like kind of the pride and the joy of the channel. The pride and the joy. Okay, that's a little much. But you guys know what I'm trying to say. They're kind of like, it's kind of like front and center. But I also feel like now, my original idea of like doing a save file, I slowly but surely feel like a lot of people are doing the same idea and it's like not so original anymore. But it is to me because I, I was one of the people like I feel like other than like Little Simsy and Plumbella and there's like a few other Tumblr people. I really don't feel like there was really a lot of save files like when I started this. I don't know if anybody really remembers like when I really started this, but yeah, it was it was a very 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 original idea and and I will like stand to this to the day I die. <laughs> and I still love doing this even though I feel like there's quite a few now that are maybe similar to mine and I try to do things that like are um a little different than like ones that are out there so yeah but I also want to think about new ideas too as we like come up to you know a new season I guess well it's fall is a new season I don't know well a new like season the seasons as season change like the channel changes and things like that I don't know what I'm trying to say but I think you guys you guys will know what I'm trying to say <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I don't, what makes you think you will? But yeah, I think you guys will will enjoy like some different content here and there too. Cause like I I've been really coming along. Like I am now on the third town. I kind of want to add um like like uh the herbs like Sim City to the save file eventually as well. Um in San which is in San Machino currently. So like after that, I don't know what plans I have for the save file. If I'm gonna keep going. If with my own sims or be inspired off of more like throwback sims I don't know we could see as time goes on but yeah I just wanted to think about think about other things on the channel as well with you guys you let me know too if I did kind of like the photo kind of justice I know it's like is slightly different it was only meant to be inspired but yeah i'm willing to see if you guys actually like it if you guys enjoy this and again it's up on the gallery and i hope you guys enjoy the screenshots make sure you guys follow my other social media and subscribe here we're so close to 3,000 subscribers and i love you guys all to bits and pieces so bye bye bye
out and get by We can learn to love what we have I don't wanna let you down